Hello everybody, I will demonstrate how to remove a sprue from lithium desilicate material, Emax in this case. Here I have a pressed button with posterior crown of the Emax. So I will be using diamond disc to cut off the sprue. I'll be using the NTI black disc to smooth and uh, cardinal blue wheel to polish the spot. So very important with lithium disilicate is not to overheat it. So this is how I do it. Always put margins towards your thumb so you won't cut them by mistake. When you uh, start cutting, don't apply any pressure don't stay on the same spot for a long time because you will overheat and create micro cracks. So this is how I do it. I'm just going one direction, cut and remove and give it like a split a second to cool down. And you can feel if you put finger, it's not even warm. So it's not overheat and creates micro cracks. So here we cut the sprue. We still have a piece of a sprue attached to the crown. So that's where the NTI will come in handy. Same, same idea. I cover margins with my finger, and I'm going one direction, little by little, and give it a split second to cool down. And working. So you can see better working in one direction. And if you touch, it's not even warm. So this is the idea to keep it cool. And I'm not using the vacuum, which is not good, but you won't hear anything if I use one. So just going over it, smoothing the edges. When it's almost over, I'm changing it to Cardinal Blue Wheel. This is the Cardinal Blue Wheel. It's a very good uh, wheel to adjusting contacts and uh, margins. And same, same way, cover the margins and just go over the screw spot and polish it so it will be flashed with the rest of the crown. And don't apply any pressure. Don't don't be on one spot for a long period of time because it will heat up. So just little by little. These abrasives are pretty good for working with lithium dust circuit. And here it is. Sprue removed and it's nicely polished. Hope it helps.